County leaders say they're concerned over the area's image. NBC 26's Alex Hagan is live at 5 with their reaction. Alex? Well, it's not just law enforcement receiving criticism. Phone calls and emails are coming into everyone calling the Manitowoc area corrupt, something city and county leaders hope passes in time. You know, I challenge you to come here and see for yourself what kind of community we have. Manitowoc County, usually known for its shoreline, we have a now known as the yet? venue of a Netflix documentary. Most of them uh, um, seem to be disgruntled in some way about our community. Jason Ring at the Manitowoc Area Convention and Visitors Bureau says the documentary has put a negative light on the county, setting aside all that's positive. The Netflix doesn't capture all of that, and it, it focuses just on one very narrow negative aspect. Aspect um, of our community that happened a long time ago. They see Manitowoc's name on there and they just attack us. Manitowoc's mayor Justin Nichols is receiving negative attention even when the city had nothing to do with the Stephen Avery case. He wants to send a message to those outside the state of Wisconsin. And that we're safe, we're clean, we have a good education system, we're, we're, we're located in a, in a wonderful spot in the United States. And we want them to think of lighthouses and sailboats. Hoping in time this all blows over. Now, Ring says in terms of tourism, he hasn't seen any changes in people traveling to Manitowoc County. I'm Alex Hagan with NBC 26.